The Future Student TV. Inspiring people with a vision about the future. Hi, I'm Ronald van Rooyen and I'm 28 years old and I am the owner of Website Group. After my secondary school, I started working at KPMG and in the last year of KPMG, I started this company. Uh, because I couldn't make it enough money at, uh, with this company in the beginning yet, I became a professional poker player and uh, I earned my money with that, just like Bill Gates did when he started Microsoft. Yeah, it's just my passion to get out of bed in the morning, expand boundaries and do new things. I started my study at my age of 19. I did a bachelor degree in six years next to my full-time work as an auditor at KPMG. Uh, when I finished this, I did a pre-master in a total different uh, field of work. I did entrepreneurship because I liked it for starting my company. I already started my company at the last year at KPMG. So then I studied uh, for an entrepreneur while I was an entrepreneur. I always studied beside my business and I'm still studying now, but all this studying made me think about how universities are working and how study is done. And I think universities are overrated. Universities uh, make, make you study things in books, while actually you can look the information up on the internet. Why would you study a book when you can just type it in in Google and find your information if you want it? For example, I'm doing this course now, evaluating your business. When you, when you look uh, in your book, you see how you have to evaluate a business. But when you actually, in a year from now, or even in five years, want to evaluate your business, you're not going to look it up in your book. You're going to search on the internet, and there you see how you have to evaluate your business. I think the role of universities can change in this. I don't think that the universities should, uh, should tell you what, what you need to know, but they should tell you how you can search for these things. They, should, they, shouldn't, uh, they shouldn't be uh, describing you how things work, but they should describe you how you can look up how these things work. This will make university life a much shorter, and then you can do a lot of things that you love to study next to the university. Lecturers will become a sparring partner for students to talk to uh, and give them advice about anything that they need. If they can't find something or if they think that they need help starting a business, or doing any innovative project that they would like any help with, lecturers should be ready for that. And the uh, amount of time that lecturers need will be much smaller now. Because uh, I have this new vision on how universities should work, I also have a bit of advice for uh, students that are studying right now. I think that you shouldn't wait to do the things you love till while, when you finish your study. I think you should do it right now. My second advice to students is that you shouldn't expect that everything will always work out for you. I think uh, success always comes through sacrifice. If you sacrifice stuff, then you can be successful. A company will never be successful at first. You always have to give it uh, some time. Maybe it costs you years, maybe even more. But uh, if you just keep hanging on and just your company will not die, then you will be successful in the end. Even if you're a successful sportman, artist, banker, politician, doesn't matter. Success comes through sacrifice. Because after you finish your study, the expectations of you from your parents and other friends and stuff are that you're going to make money. And if you want to do uh, things that you love, like starting a company or learning how to code, you can only do it while you're studying. So do it now. The Future Student TV. Inspiring people with a vision about the future.